Introducing GoPixel, LMI Technologies 3D Measurement and Inspection Platform. GoHMI is a separate but tightly integrated human machine interface development tool which can create and display customized views of system and inspection metrics for monitoring and controlling your inspection system on the production floor. GoHMI responsive design capability allows creating content that adjusts smoothly to various screen sizes such as desktop and touch-enabled devices. This walkthrough demonstrates how to take a measurement from GoPixel and output it in GoHMI Designer, as well as export and import a project. Note that GoHMI Designer runs in a separate Windows application. First, open GoPixel. Access and run the downloaded folder of the GoPixel user tools package. Click on the GoPixel shortcut to run GoPixel on PC. Click on the instance you want to run and click Launch. For this example, we will use a support file called HMI underscore sample dot GPSUP that is located in the sample recordings package. This support file includes a surface scan recording sample of a 3D printed target captured with a GoCater sensor and some tools such as the surface bounding box tool. Go to the support page and upload the file. Go to the tools page, click surface bounding box 2, ensure width is selected as a tool output. Navigate to the HMI page and ensure the service is enabled. This will establish the communication between the sensor and HMI application. By default, a sample GoHMI project is shipped with GoPixel. The default app contains some measurement outputs and sensor information as examples. These and other outputs that you add are available under the Data to Send section. Now we will map the measurement output to our GoHMI app. At the bottom of the Data to Send section, open the drop-down menu and select the Surface Bounding Box 2 Width value. The selected outputs will show up in the Data to Send list. Behind the scenes, these are being mapped and made available in GoHMI Designer. Now let's edit the default application to display the measurement output that we just mapped. Open the GoPixel underscore user tools folder. Click GoHMI Designer shortcut. A GoHMI Designer launcher box will open. Select the GoPixel instance you want to connect to GoHMI. In this example, we will connect to the GoPixel on PC instance that we launched earlier. Click Launch. GoHMI Designer will open in a new window. Ensure that GoHMI Designer shows Connected at the bottom of the login screen. The default username is GoHMI, and the default password is also GoHMI. Under the Project Information tab, click Load to start editing the default GoHMI app. In the Project Dashboard and under the Design column, click Layout Manager. In the Hierarchy panel, expand Panels and select Panel. In the Designer Workspace, click the Enter button to enter into the Panels section that was designed as part of this sample GoHMI app. On the top of the Workspace, select the Tools. Now, let's add a new graphic widget to graph the tool's width, which we mapped earlier. At the bottom of the main panel, select the Widget List button. Drag and drop Radial Gauge widget to the panel. You will see blue lines appear when the widget is selected. The widget will show no value and no label. So let's populate those with our measurement output. With the widget selected, click on the Config panel. In the Data Attributes section, click the three-dot button. Search Width to narrow down the list of available data items. Select Surface Bounding Box Width.Value. Click Apply. The widget should now show the value of the measurement chosen. With the widget still selected, click on the Style panel. Scroll down to the Styling section. For this example, let's change the color of the value. In the drop-down menu, select Value. 
Under Typography, click Font Color and choose a color. This will change the font color of the widget value. You can select all different elements of the widget, such as label, in the same manner. Once done, you can easily copy and paste the styled widget without having to repeat the styling process, like these other two widgets here. Click on the preview icon at the top of the visualizer to open the preview window. Resize the window to ensure the app is well designed and fits your target device. Click on the home icon in the top left corner of the screen. Navigate to Project Dashboard. In the Application column, click on the Publish and Close. This will save the application to your local machine. Back in GoPixel, the status shows Ready, which means that it is available for exporting or viewing live. After you finalize your GoHMI project, it can be downloaded and imported to another GoPixel instance. The export functionality in GoPixel will package the app as a zip file and download it to your system. In order to do this, in HMI page, click on the Export button. Now that you've developed a GoHMI application, it is time to view it live on a device. Let's first import the app into a sensor. Go to the support page and upload the same support file that we used before. In HMI page, click Import to bring your newly developed app into your sensor. Click Start. Click View Live. This will open the app in a new browser tab. You can use the same address to open the application in any other device in the same network. Welcome to GoPixel, LMI Technologies' measurement and inspection platform.